Hello, how to solve for x and y in this equation, square root of x plus square root of y is equal to 10, square root of xy is equal to 10. Then from here, square root of x plus square root of y is equal to 10. Let's call this equation 1. Square root of xy is equal to 10. Let's call this equation 2. From equation 1, we have square root of x plus square root of y is equal to 10. Let's square both sides. That is square root of x plus square root of y all square is equal to 10 square. Then this is square root of s all square plus 2 square root of s square root of y plus square root of y all square is equal to 10 square that is 100 then this we cancel this this we cancel this have x plus y plus 2 root xy is equal to 100 Number from equation 2, root of xy is equal to 10. And this is s plus y plus 2 bracket 10 is equal to 100. Then s plus y plus 2 times 10, that is 20, is equal to 100. S plus y is equal to 100 minus 20. S plus y is equal to 80. Let's call this equation 3. Also from equation 2, root of x, y is equal to 10. Let's square both sides. This we cancel this. We have sy is equal to 100. Now let's make y the subject of the formula divided by x divided by x. This we cancel this. y is equal to 100 over x. Let's call this equation 4. Then we can now substitute this equation 4 into our equation 3 here. That is from T D X plus Y is equal to 80. We want to substitute for this Y. Here is S plus 100 over S is equal to 80. In order to eliminate this S, let's multiply all through by X. S multiplied by S plus 100 multiplied by S divided by S is equal to 80 multiplied by X. This we cancel this. Then we have S times S that is S square plus 100 is equal to 80 times S that is 80X. Then this is S square minus 80 x plus 100 is equal to zero this is a quadratic equation which can be solved using quadratic general formula from quadratic general formula we have s is equal to minus p plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a and from this equation a is equal to 1 b is equal to minus 80 then c is equal to 100 then x is equal to minus bracket minus 80 plus or minus square root of minus 80 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by 100 over 2 multiplied by 1 then s is equal to minus times minus 80 that is 80 plus or minus square root of 
minus 80 squared that is 6400 minus 4 times 1 times 100 that is 400 divided by 2 and this is s is equal to 80 plus or minus square root of 6400 minus 400 that is 6000 divided by 2 s is equal to 80 plus or minus 6000 can be written as you have square root of 400 multiplied by 15 divided by 2 and s is equal to 80 plus or minus square root of 400 that is 20 root 15 over 2 and s is equal to 80 over 2 plus or minus 20 over 2 root 15 2 year 1 2 year 10 2 year 1 2 year 40 S is equal to 40 plus or minus 10 root 15. Therefore, S1 is equal to 40 plus 10 root 15. And then S2 is equal to 40 minus 10 root 15. We've got the value of S. Let's solve for Y. Now from equation 3. We have S plus Y is equal to 80. We can make Y the subject of the formula. Y is equal to 80 minus X. Now to solve, we have Y will be equal to 80 minus we know our s which is equal to 40 plus or minus 10 root 15. now in order to get our y1 we have y1 will be equal to 80 minus 40 plus 10 root 15. y1 will be equal to 80 minus 40 minus 10 root 15. Y1 will be equal to 80 minus 40, that is 40 minus 10 root 15. Also for Y2, for Y2, we have y2 will be equal to 80 minus bracket 40 minus 10 root 15 y2 is equal to 80 minus 40 plus 10 root 15 y2 is equal to 80 minus 40, that is 40 plus 10 root 15. This is the value of y2. Therefore, our final answer, s1, comma, y1 is equal to 40 plus 10 root 15 comma 40 minus 10 root 15 also s2 comma y2 is equal to 
40 minus 10 root 15 comma 40 plus 10 root 15. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.